So I'm at, uh, what, what is it called? Paradise Meadows Farms. I've been killing quite a few rabbits. I started from swinging around Milton's town to the north here, up to the church. And there's a rabbit sighting just to the west of that area, uh, where the deers are at. Which is pretty much uh, where I was exploring at the start of the, these playthroughs. I killed some of those rabbits up there, and then I swing to the south here, to Paradise Meadows Farm, where I found a few more. I've killed about seven or eight, and uh, yeah, I've been harvesting them for the rabbit pelts for Grey Mother. So we'll go, we'll go inside back to this house here. Having a real look at Grey Mother's trust points here, we have a current of 140, and we've already unlocked up to here. Which leads me to believe that we just need a total of 375 trusts to unlock her maximum requirements, which is mountaineering boots. And we've already got like, what have we got here? We got seven fresh rabbit pelts. That's 350 points in total, which is far exceeding our uh, requirement to completely, fully uh, complete her trust. So we should be all right for that. What I'm gonna do is I'll cook all these meats. I might actually do that when I get to grandmother's house. Uh, we did rack up quite a bit of rabbit meat doing this. Which is a good way to get some food sources, but it's also a bad way to uh, increase your weight here. So I'll quickly harvest this one real quick. My hatchet is going down pretty quick too. Drink some of the sodas. Now we can actually, we can survive pretty decently without having a full uh, hunger level. To save some food sources, we should really only max our hunger level when we're sleeping. But uh, we'll eat that granola bar. Candy bar. Go ahead, uh, right back outside. Oh, fuck. Get away from me. No. happening. Here we are, we're back. Oh my god, that wolf. It's coming. Go in. Quick. Woof. That was close. Okay. Now we're back. Sup, Grey Mother? Here to give you some rabbit pelts. Give items rabbit pelts quite a bit. There you go. Take all that. Let's see how much that'll give her. 375 trust. Where are we now? Alright, so we unlocked everything now. Grey Mother gives you with mountaineering boots. There's world building, information, perseverance, mills. Now, I think there was a side mission here. We've already figured out the cage location. Uh, there's a side mission, distress, pistol, the collapse, supplies. Let's go with supplies. Medical emergencies. We take care of our own. What about outsiders? I can see you'll need help. Miller's kept some kind of supply hidden in their back garden. Goods they smuggled in from the mainland didn't want anyone to know about. If you can find them, you should take them. You'll need them. I think I already took that one. The Collapse. I know it's been rough. We're already, already on our knees. Milton History Protection. Let's do that. There are a lot of wolves around. Smell your fear. You'd leave an old lady defenseless so you could protect yourself. Of course not, but it would be nice to have a bit more protection out there. Old Henry McDermott used to be with Coast Guard. The Coast Guard. He kept a distress pistol around just in case to call for help. Right, Henry was always worried about kids getting their hands on it, so it won't be easy to find things. Alright, let's check the rabbit mitt skins here. Or the rabbit skin mitts. You'll have to learn to be self-sufficient, right? 
Do we understand what that meant? When something wore out, we can just go online and order a new one. <laughs> Have it magically drawn delivered to your door. As a little girl, I already knew how to hunt rabbits and turn their skins into clothes. I'll tell you how it's done. Pretty sure that means you just gave us the crafting uh, information for that. Better boots, mountaineering boots. You won't get far in this rugged turn if you don't have the right footwear. You may have to take what you find left behind. My feet are fine. Don't be so stubborn, mainlander. Take these old boots. They belong to my. Oh, never mind. Just take them. They are some of the best you can get for climbing. They'll help you. They'll help keep you going. Look at that. She just gave it to me. There we go. There's our rabbit skin mitts. So we need cured rabbit pelt. I need three more. I already got one. I need some cured gut. I think I have some cured gut upstairs, actually. Yeah, I got- Oh, I actually got some cured gut here. Okay, there you go. Take all that. Guess I forgot to pick it up. Now we just need three more cured rabbit pelt. Not sure if I have some upstairs in that cabinet. Ah, oh, but that's gonna take quite a bit. That's for sure. Time required, five hours. Wow. The stats look good, though. A bit worried about that movement speed, but... A lot of protection. For wind, water, temperature. Ah, the boots. Let's check the boots. Decent mountaineering boots. So it weighs less, which is great. We've got nice movement speed. Uh, I got wind resistance, water resistance here, and body temperature. Alright, we got now. Warmth bonus 16 degrees Celsius. Windproof bonus 6 degrees Celsius. Protection 14%. Good, good, good. Looking good for us. Alright, next place we need to check is that tunnel collapse. That must be the distress pistol. Light up the night. We can check that real quick and then head down that bus looking thing down there so it's about it's three houses down from our current location so wait here we are 32.11 kilograms I'm say looking all right we'll save our stamina here It's pretty cold outside, it seems. That's our vehicle. Did I check this car? Can't remember if I did. Nope. Nothing there anyway. Some boarded up house. So just having a look at this exclamation mark, it seems to be above. So maybe on top of the hill up here. I'm also not sure if I check this house. We may have missed this one actually. Let's go. Let's go inside. Let's see what's Old in there. McDermott must have hidden that weapon in here somewhere. Ah, so this is Henry McDermott's house. Get some books. We got plenty of these fire resources. Fireplace. Get some more newsprints. I can always use more food. Newsprint. Yeah, we got plenty of that right now. Newsprint turned into Tinder plug is pretty much the only thing I know what we can do with that. Kitchen here. We've got tons of clothing. We don't need it. Cloth. Uh, let's check the top cabinets here. I'll be hungry later. More sardines. Canned food. That's always nice. Nothing in there. Nothing in the oven. Fuel, yep. I can always use more food. Canned food again. That's just another entry. Canned food again. Just soup. Hey, I nearly missed that. It's a soda. Need a knife to break down. Okay. That's nah, just a one-story house. 
It's a pretty big TV. Worn spot socks. Uh, point one. It's not gonna hinder us in our way. Have we here? A decent down vest. I've already got like. I've already got those, so I'm not gonna pick them up. Oh, how much were you on water here? 0.42. Maybe we'll pick up uh, 0.5. Should be alright with that. Uh, da -da 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 -da. No, nothing else. No hidden loots and such in the toilet. A hidden cache. Wow. Under the rug. Just what I need. So that's what the flare shells are for. Quite a lot of them too. Uh, where is it under? Is it under fire? Or maybe here, weapons. The flare shells actually don't weigh that much, which is good. 0.40 kilograms. Into the air, fires, flare shells. Maybe I should, uh, fire one now, eh? See what happens. Alrighty. Let's try out this flare gun. Uh, reload. Aim up and shoot. Oh, you think anyone's gonna see that? Wow, that came down real quick. Oh well, if anyone did manage to see that, they'll uh, bump right into grandmother's house. Just about to hit midday. As we pass this Orca gas station. If I remember correctly from the last few playthroughs, there's a nice stack of pallets down there for fire sources. So if we happen to catch a really bad blizzard... There's a deer right there. We can just spend the night in that station. Must be another dead carcass. Oh, the wolf's munching on his breakfast. Let's just uh, avoid him. And let him do his thing. There's the bus. Must be another dead thing down here. More crows. Gotta keep an eye out for crow feathers. I need that. For crafting. Hopefully there's some that'll drop here. Oh my god, who's that? Dead corpse? Better not be Astrid. Crashed prison transport bus. Oh, it's an inmate. Makes sense. Crow feather. That's what I need. Painkillers. Yep. Thank you. Perseverance. Alright, let's see what the journal says now. Light of the night, Milton supply cache. People, places, things. Astrid's hard case. Oh! I guess we just go back to Grandmother. She might have something to know. I'll check this briefcase as well. Transport Manifest. The following felons are slated to immediate transport to Black Rock Federal Penitentiary. Thursday, November XX20XX. 12 inmates, none. That'll come handy. That uh, cinematic was a little bit buggy than usual. There seems to be an uh, off-road to the left here. I wonder where that's gonna take us. I don't if there's anything there. Let's go explore! I'm not sure what's up there. Could be... It's probably nothing, but... Got a little bit of time left to check, I guess.
Let's see a note. What does the note say? Park warning notice. The Milton and Area Parks Board can no longer condone the use of the climbing area within the park boundaries. Additionally, recent seismic activity has brought the safety of several some common routes and climbing sections into question. Da -da 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 -da. Until then, climbing, you say? Let's go check that out. See a broken down house up there. Or well, it's just open. I think it's just open. With windows. What happened to this place? Let's check inside. More sodas, which is nice. Drink some of that now, actually. Give me some calories, at least. And maybe we'll consume a candy bar as well. There it is, right there. Granola bar. There you go, Mackenzie. You got some food crates. Got 35.22. Got more fire shells. This stuff will come in handy. Emergency stand bandage, yep, we'll take that. Uh, we'll take the flare shell. Anything significant here? We got a few drawers. Crunchy stuff, yes, we'll take that. Ah, we got a fire stove. How cold is it inside? 10 degrees Celsius. Kinda looks like that window's broken, but at the same time... I think that's just the ice build up. Take that soda. Orange soda. This will come in handy. Scrap metal. I don't know if I want to get this. They're they're quite weighty, actually. Point two. We'll stash it in our little cabinet for now. Use print. Flare shell. Yeah, we'll take that. I'm racking up quite a bit of flare shells. I think that's it for this place. No notes, nothing. Yep. We'll uh, go back out here. Climbing area. Wonder what that means. I see. This is the drop off. Picnic area. I wonder what's down there. We don't exactly have the rope to make anything. It's a big bunch of nothingness. Can't really see with this fog. Willing to bet the scenery would be much better if it was clear weather. Benches, yes, I knew we can bake that. Break that down to some uh, reclaimed wood for fire. We don't really need to do that now though, so let's take these rose hips. That's probably it for this area. And we'll just head back. We're still looking good.